go. I'm going to demonstrate to you how to remove the meat from a crab once it's been cleaned and cooked. Um, and it's called shaking, a, shaking the crab. Uh, it was taught to me by an old Indian. It's an old Indian trick and it makes it a lot faster and quicker to get the meat out of your crab. First thing you want to do is you have your meat, your crab leg. It's all separated and clean. You want to separate each individual leg. You can see the uh, you can see the separations between each leg and the body. First thing you want to do is just kind of squeeze the meat just a little bit. That lo loosens it up. You break off each individual leg with the body, and that separates one one leg. And we can break off each leg individually and the body meat on its own. So you have four separate pieces of meat, or five, excuse me, five. So first thing we want to do is we're going to take the meat out of the body here, which was the body. And what we're going to do is we're going to have a bowl here that has a nice rim around it. And we're going to shake, we're going to hit the uh, leg of the le joint across this bowl and that'll shake this meat out here just give it a kind of a sharp shake and as you can see the meat's in the bowl and your body is empty we can set that aside or we can pull this joint out and then that, we'll start at the uh, tip pull this joint out and make sure you get the tendons out once your tendons are out you can crack and squeeze that part, break off a small piece, like so, and then again we're going to strike the knuckle and shake this part of the meat out. And there's your piece of meat, and your shell's empty. Break the joint off, make sure you get the tendons out again, strike the knuckle, And there's your piece of meat and an empty shell. Break the joint backwards. Pull the tendons out again. Now we can crack that one. And we'll turn it over and strike the knuckle again. Shell is empty and you got a whole piece of meat. That's one leg. Here we have another one of our other legs here. Here's the body. We'll strike the uh, knuckle. Just give it a sharp, a sharp shake. All the meat's empty. You can break all that off and get that out of the way. Now we'll. Now that we've done the body, we'll go to the leg part. We got to break the. Uh, we'll start at the point at the end. You got to break the shell backwards and then pull it out. And you got to pull the tendons out here. If you don't pull the tendons out, the meat won't come out correctly because it'll stick to the tendons. So now that we've got the tendon out, we'll give the leg a crack, break open a small piece. That allows the meat to come out. We'll strike the we'll strike the leg at the joint once again. Give it a nice sharp shake. And sometimes there we go. Most of the meat comes out in large chunks. We got to break this joint off here. Pull these tendons out. Give it a sharp hit on there, and there's your large piece of meat. No cracking involved. Pull that one out. Give it a sharp hit whole piece of meat, nothing left. And it's that quick. We'll do one more here. Pull back. Crack. Open.
And there you go. Now we'll go to the claw. The claw. We're going to start with the claw. We'll shake the body out. Break the excess off. We'll pull the claw off. Pull the tendons out. Crack the bottom off. Then we'll, again, strike the knuckle. And there's your whole piece of meat. Make sure you don't have any few pieces of shell. This one's a little bit harder. Break that off. It'll come out. And give it a strike again. Piece of meat. Break that one out. Uh -huh. And a large piece of meat. Empty shell. That is basically cracking a crab and shaking a crab. That's shaking a crab. Um, comes out meaty and it's a lot faster than actually picking the crab out. 